gonna be so good <laughs> yeah if that even worked what's that thing you say uh let's not start pushing before the pen is pulled down of course it's gonna work with all of your talent and mine put together how could it fail stop it you're gonna be bad luck want a better creamberry fondue that it's gonna so either way we're having fondue tonight correct works for me Swing by the vegetable patch when we're done playing around. I saw a few nice ones yesterday that looked almost right. I wonder why we're bothering to plan to build everything. When we could just focus on intensive creamery cultivation. We need a little variety in our diet, lest we get tired. Getting tired of you yet? All right. Are we gonna have this fondue? Yes. Great. The weather is kind of nice. Do you want to set up outside? Definitely. Start the fondue. I'll set the table. Whew. I didn't think we'd get through all that. What's for a dessert? You have some room left? I'm kidding. We do have some Afrobrew left. All right, then. We are on vacation, after all. Every day is vacation. Exactly. To us. And to source.
Which reminds me, we're gonna have to tape up the nest's flow intake tomorrow. I think I saw a leak. Yes. And also, we need to consider pruning our apple dew buds. They're gonna take over the whole vegetable patch if we let them. Bloat. Guess we're not on vacation after all. Ah, uh, well. We can rest when we're old. Okay, the only things we do here are cooking, handiwork, and gardening. We are. You're right. Wait. We haven't checked the gauge. Oh, yeah. I almost forgot. So, what does it say? 0 0.174 minus 0 0.090 plus 0 0.122. Huh. It's more than yesterday. A lot more? Not much, but it kind of confirms our theory. Source's orbit has deviated. Hmm. Other than that, I'm not seeing the bridge. Looks like it's not forming back. At least that's some good news. Now we can sleep some. Are you asleep? Not really. This really isn't the time. Don't you want to go into the bedroom and- Yes. Let's go. decision I've ever made in my life by a very long stretch. I thought I would feel changed, like an entirely new person. But no, I'm not feeling any. I don't think I've taken it all in yet. You know, it's kind of like when someone you don't see much dies. You understand it, you but really, concretely, it changes absolutely nothing in your daily life. The only difference compared to before is that you wouldn't be able to see that person if you wanted to. And you really don't remember they're dead until you want to see them. Right now, it feels like the entire apiary is dead. Even if I wanted to, I wouldn't be able to go back. Does that make you... It doesn't make me anything. Sad, happy, nothing. You know, I don't think it's hit me yet. I'd like it to stay that way, actually. I really hope it never... Um... Will you tell me if that happens? <sighs> Who else could I tell? What about you? About the same. Having a hard time taking it. Sorry, I meant your skin. Does it still hurt? <laughs> I don't know if it's the lufocrit oil or if my immune system has accepted it, but I almost can't feel anything. Before you asked, I'd actually forgotten all about it. That should tell you something. But I guess it's easier for me to forget than it is for you. Don't say that. What? Am I wrong? I'm not the one living with an ankylocephalus. You're not an ankylocephalus. I bet you don't even know what that is. No. But it sounds ugly. And you're not ugly. I actually find these spikes right here kind of sexy. More places to hold on to. Or stab yourself. <laughs> Whichever. Yeah. Since you brought it up. I did have one of your spikes poke me in the back earlier today. Oh, Blute, I I'm so sorry. No, no, it's okay. It was just a little while. All I'm saying is that we may have to think of other positions. Mm, okay. When do we start? Whenever. Now? You have no patience. <laughs> <laughs> 